Hey everyone! Today, I'm going to show you how to download and install Reshade for Star Stable and how to use presets. Let's get started. Open your web browser and go to the official website, reshade.me. Click on the download button and then choose Download Reshade with full add-on support. Open the Reshade setup file you just downloaded. Don't worry, Star Stable does not ban for the use of Reshade, so click OK. In the setup window, Click on Browse. Now, you need to find the folder where you installed Star Stable Online. Open the drive where your game is installed, usually in Program Files. Look for the folder called Star Stable Online. Inside this folder, open folder named Client and select the file SSO, client.exe. Once you select the file, Reshade will ask you to pick a rendering API. For Star Stable Online, Choose OpenGL. After that, you'll see a list of effects you can install. Just simply select everything and click Next. Reshade will download these effects, which might take a minute, so be patient. Click on Skip. Once the installation is done, Close the Reshade setup. Now just open Star Stable Online as usual. When the game loads, you should see that Reshade is now installed successfully appear at the top of the screen. This means it's working. To open the Reshade menu in-game, press the Home key on your keyboard. Reshade will show you a quick tutorial on how to turn effects on and off. But you can skip it if you want. That's it. Now you have Reshade installed. Now we have to make a few changes to the reshade settings to make it work. Click on the button at the bottom called Edit Global Preprocessor Definitions. And here, change reshade depth input is upside down, from 0 to 1. Then click on Add-ons at the top, and there check Copy Depth Buffer before clear operations. You can also choose a shortcut key in the settings to turn the reshade preset off and on. Just simply click here and press the shortcut key of your choice. Now I'll show you how to download presets and how to use them in the game. If you want a preset, you can check out my Kofi page where you'll find lots of presets to choose from. After you download the preset file, go to the folder where you installed Reshade. For better clarity, create a new folder here called, for example, Presets. Then copy the preset file, .ini file, and paste it into this folder. This way, Reshade can detect it in-game. If you want to use a preset that changes the background, you put the preset in the same place, but you have to put the image that was attached to the preset in a different folder. Go back to the Client folder, open the Reshade Shaders folder, then the Texture folder, and paste the image in there. Now you have a preset ready to use. Open the Reshade menu by pressing Home on your keyboard. In the Reshade menu, look for a drop-down menu at the top. Click on the drop-down, open the folder we just created, and you should see the name of the preset you added. Select the preset to apply it to your game, and the preset should load. That's it! Now you have a Reshade presets and you're good to go. I hope you enjoyed this video and that it helped. If you have any problems with Reshade, I can recommend you to check some Discord Reshade servers, where someone will help you to solve the problem. I would also be happy if you support me on my Ko-fi, where you can choose the presets you like. See you again in the next video. Bye.